Yo, what is going on YouTube? It is J or AK Mojo Sports coming at you guys with a huge recap. I went to two card shops. I opened a hobby box. I've got mail to open and I bought a little mini collection this past week. I hope everyone's doing well. Happy New Year. Merry Christmas to every single person on here. From my family to yours, happy holidays. I want to thank you all so much. And with that, we are going to be giving away, boom, true sports cards numbered 135 out of 250. One guarantee slab authenticated baseball autograph per box. That's right, guys. We're giving this away. All you have to do is follow True Sports Cards on Instagram and follow Mojo Autographs on Instagram. Subscribe to Mojo Sports and comment what card show, if you could go to any card show in 2022, where do you guys want to go? Do you want to go to Boston? Do you want to go to Dallas? That's all you have to do. We're going to pick one random comment next week to win this box. I'm going to ship it sealed to one winner, one slabbed autograph, 75 different Hall of Famers. Shout out to True Sports Cards, my boys Imran and Chep. Spent five hours with those two men and it was so fun. We, we talked about cars, talked about the hobby and it was just great. Um, I ended up picking up some stuff there. So they have provided this box and we are going to be giving it away. So True Sports Cards right there. Enter the giveaway. Appreciate you guys so much at True Sports Cards. And with that, let's get into our recap. So let's start it off. I opened two packages off camera. Um, shout out to Glenn. Merry Christmas, buddy. Hope to see you at the Bay Area show again real soon. Glenn from Canada sent me these Winnipeg Jets stickers right here. Winnipeg Jets, so pretty cool. Really appreciate that, Glenn. And this next one is really sick. A mojo for mojo. Thank you for everything you do. You're an inspiration. Keep up the good work. Looking forward to meeting you in person one day. Happy holidays, Mike. Right there, shout out to Mike. And he sent me a Demarcus Cousins 24 or 25 mojo refractor. So that's very fitting. I did not have this card. Demarcus Cousins right there. He's playing very well for the Milwaukee Bucks. So happy to see that and I cannot wait to get out to Milwaukee to watch him play I'm very excited for him and very happy for him and his team. So that's awesome right there next up Let's do a little recap. I did buy a collection and I just want to show you guys some stuff um, Just highlights of it I did move some of it and some of the stuff I did keep off to the side and this is some of the stuff I haven't uh, moved so I'll put his link down below I met up with a guy in Vacaville, California about 30 40 minutes away from Sacramento We did a deal. Um, we talked online and we met up so anybody that wants to know how to do deals usually they're local make an instagram make a social media account and get plugged in you can sell your cards you can trade them and you can buy there's a huge community that it's perfect it's literally perfect for this thing i know a lot of people are you know not into social media but i'm telling you if you don't use instagram you're missing out you're really missing out on on the ability to connect with other collectors and actually get some really amazing cards as like an auxiliary to this whole thing besides friendship so i picked these up i met the guy up at the vacaville outlets it's actually an awesome spot. They have a Nike outlet out there. Then I bought these cards. So I'll show you guys what I picked up. First off, Isaac Okoro on card auto for the Cavs. Playing very well right there. Next picked up a Jason Dominguez, Mojo Refractor. Um, Aaron Neesmith, private signings on card auto. I really thought he and Romeo Langford were going to do a lot better, but they just signed Joe Johnson, who actually just played tonight. It was actually cool to see that. Uh, Peyton Pritchard right there. Shout out to my boy Lane. Rip it and chip it. Uh, that's his boy. Sean Murphy on card auto. Uh, Ryan Tannehill blue. Color match on that. Jalen Dylan Smith Silver. Corbin Burns Auto actually played pretty good last year. Kevin Newman out of 20. And then this is my first Tyrese Halliburton Auto. Contenders Auto right there. Pick that up. Um, pretty sick right here from Stockton, California. <laughs> Nate Diaz Refractor. Nate Diaz UFC 2014 Chrome Refractor right there. Ooh, 2017. That was close. I picked up this. Shout out to Evan Longoria. He's a huge collector. It's going to get a PSA 5, but I had to pick up a Longo. Um, little mini PC. Anytime I see cards of him, um, I just love that. He plays baseball and he collects. He's one of us. Totally a uh, total card collector. So Evan Longoria, I had to. Um, like I said, it's creased down the middle, but um, you got you to gotta take what you can take. I think that's like the second or third one of that card I have. This is pretty sick. I picked up the Stephen Curry at a 49. He just broke the record a couple weeks ago. Steph Curry, purple at a 49. Very clean card. Uh, Ronnie Mauricio, been picking up a couple of these. Guys, this guy's cards. Prospect. Chase Young, Silver, Prism. My first Kaboom. Ben Simmons, of all people. Where do you guys think Ben Simmons is going? Comment down below. Where is Ben Simmons going to play? Do not say the Sacramento Kings, please. Do not say that. Next, uh, Tom Brady Red. Shout out to my boy Corey Klimas. Tampa Bay right there. TB. Uh, Brandon Roy out of 10. Funny uniform, but cool rare autograph right there, Brandon Roy. He did sign the number right. Number three, he was three on the Wolves. Reed Detmers out of 150. Angels auto. Ian Book auto from Notre Dame. Davis Mills. And then lastly, the slab I picked up. I actually really like this guy. I watched him play in AAA and uh, got to get 
get his autograph a handful of times. Really cool guy, Matt Chapman, PSA 10 autograph, first Bowman Chrome auto right there, Matt Chapman. So pretty sick right there. And then next, I did spend some time at True Sports Cards, uh, Imran and Shep. Shep's the manager, Imran's the owner. I could go to that shop. I'm telling you guys, I could sit in that shop for three to five hours and I just, I mean, I bought all this. Um, got a great deal on all this stuff. Um, you know, the sticker prices say what they do, but you can sit down with these guys and, and they're more than willing to do a couple deals. And I bought a bunch of stuff from them and just class acts. So True Sports Cards, um, like I said, they're just amazing. I'll put the link down below. You guys got to hit that shop. Um, I picked up a bunch of stuff. Shout out to Card Collector to Ryan. You know I love the bargain bins just as good as, just as much as he does. Um, I did pick up some, uh, just uh, ironically, I picked up Lakers stuff. <laughs> Shaquille O'Neal um, picked up some cool Shaq cards right here. Just some old 90s inserts. Nothing crazy, nothing high end. Um, Shaquille O'Neal right there. So just some cool Shaq cards. I grew up watching Shaq, so figured why not. Um, so picked up a bunch of Shaqs. This is kind of a cool one. This was from uh, 99, I remember that card. Ooh, it's raining right now. It is raining as I film this, I can hear it. Um, next, this is such a sentimental set. Kobe Anthrology, if you did not collect, they collected in 2012, um, you know, Kobe Anthrology. They put a Kobe pack in each hobby box. So if any of you are looking for that pack, I'm gonna tell you right now, just from my own personal odds, I opened a lot of wax. You did not have, a, I never pulled an autograph. I never pulled a numbered card and I opened tons of hobby boxes. I um, mean, it wasn't as common as you think in those anthology packs, but they did a Kobe commemorative set. So I don't know what it is. I just, I pick them up, man. I, I just, it's not an expensive set. It's not rare by any means. It's kind of like the Jordan legacy set, but this Kobe anthology set's amazing. I picked up a ton of these Kobe, you know, commemorative cards. Also remember this team, Carl Malone and Gary Payton. Oh boy, that was a disaster. Um, but anyway, picked up those anthology. You ever just pick up something up for nostalgia? That's, that's kind of what that hit for me. So I, I definitely had to, you know, pick those up. Um, next, we'll get into some uh, just hits and some other things. Picked up a Tony Pollard. This is miscellaneous $3 pickups. Um, like I said, I got these for a little bit less. Tony Pollard, Jersey card. Willis McGahee auto right there. I remember watching him as a kid. This is kind of cool. Shout out to my boys, 414 Sports MKE, and shout out to Viva Gallardo and uh, Stay Freak 34, Milwaukee boys. Um, shout out to Brad Thanasis. Ante de Kumbo, Jersey Auto right there. Thought that was pretty cool right there, Thanasis. Shout out to Top 10 Tony as well from Milwaukee. So I picked up that Thanasis, Ante de Kumbo. It was a cool card. I actually looked up comps, you know, not, not, a, not a bad buy, so pretty cool. Next, Cowboys, Malik Hooker, shout out to M Chief. Tyler Bass, Auto for the Bills. Jeffrey Simmons, Auto. Shout out to Preston Penn, my boy from Tennessee. Um, Lendell White, Auto. Shout out to Dal Dalton Sports Cards as well. This is kind of cool. Byron Leftwich, he's the quarterback coach of the Bucks. That's not why I picked this up. I it was just I remember watching Byron Leftwich and I thought this was a cool card right there. Byron Leftwich auto. He was a beast, but David Garrard. Remember David Garrard in Madden? He was a poor man's Michael Vick. Joe Washington, uh, Zach Ertz. And then I played D tackle and D end when I played in high school. And I got a lot of, you know, I like watching those guys play and I do pick up their cards. I picked up an Aaron Donald at a 149. Jeffrey Simmons auto at a 199. I always liked this guy from Stanford. It's just, you know, I I always respected his game and him as a person and I know he gave football up um, shout out to AG Adriana from alt I know she's a huge Colts fan but I picked this up at a 125 Andrew Luck right there and then picked up this green ink auto peculiar but Paul pulls Nolsney auto I love that it's the green ink auto 2007 so 14 years later and it still looks good and green so that's pretty cool to see that Albert uh, cool. Bonham auto seen him play a little bit for the Broncos had to pick that up Alton Robinson auto for the Seahawks these are bargain bins. I mean, you, you can go through this box all day. I would pay three to five bucks for half this stuff anyway. Harold Landry Auto for the Titans. It's a beast. So pick those up. Um, some dollar bin stuff. Just show these. Dawson Knox, Albert, Albert Pink, Marquez Valdez Scantling, Antonio Gates X Fractor, BJ Raji. I remember love watching this guy play, man. X Fractor right there. A couple Odell Beckham Jr. rookies. It looks like he's fitting in well with the Rams. Jerome Robinson rated rookies. Mike Evans, Bowman Chrome. Shout out to my boy, Corey. Definitely going to send that your way for you. Marquise Brown, uh, Tremaine Edmonds, Derek Henry, college rookies. I know he's out for the year. God, he was playing so go good. Jonathan Taylor though, man. He's the guy this year now. Mike Evans, kind of a cool die cut football. I, I always, I got a lot a lot of love for Mike Evans, man. Um, my boy, Corey lives out in Tampa Bay. He's the one that took us to the Bucks game and he told me Mike Evans is just a stand-up guy. He signs autographs, just a cool dude. 
dude. So I've always respected him off on the field, but off the field, that that that's awesome right there. So that's cool. Um, next up, some more little three dollar pickups. Eli Apple Auto. Shout out Garnett Sports Cards. I know he's a Giants fan. I know Eli Apple's not on the Giants, but Shaq Gold. Xavier Rhodes Game Used. Jordan Brooks Auto to 149. Nice looking card. Hollywood Brown, Marquise Brown. This is kind of cool. Blake Bortles. It's Game Used. 10 to 25. It actually looks like there's a little dirt there. Game Used Blake Bortles Letter Patch. I like that. Shout out to my boy Landon, aka Playmaker Sports. Shout out to Landon. That's his friend right there, literally. Lil Jordan Humphrey. What a name. Pulsar Auto. Marquise Brown Premier Materials. Another Willis McGahee Auto. Like I said, I watched him growing up. So three to five bucks for an autograph. I really can't beat that these days. Calvin Ridley Jersey card. This one's pretty cool. Jerry Judy color match. I know it's select, but I like a good color match. It's kind of cool. I call these the firefighter cards. Look at them. Looks like the fire chief kind of thing. We knew some fi our neighbors a firefighter over here, actually. Shaquille O'Neal. Ty Jerome Auto. Mike Evans die cut. Nice looking card right there. Shout out to my boy, Corey. Colton Wong. I always liked Colton Wong. I thought that was sick. On card auto. Colton Wong right there. Lil Jordan Humphrey Auto. This is pretty sick. Mike Evans out of 99. Purple. Nice looking card. Saquon Barkley right there. Penn State kid. I love this guy. Love the way this guy plays. His dad was a beast too. Antoine Winfield Jr. Silver. Love that right there. Um, this is pretty cool. Shout out to the Kentucky Roadshow. Shout out to Jimmy. Out of 199. A little Keldon Johnson. Green and purple. Nice card right there. And this guy's playing out of his mind. I have him on my fantasy team. Unbelievable year. DeMar DeRozan. Matt Ryan. Shout out to Tiger Woods and Charlie Woods. Oh, it's so fun watching him. I just, I love seeing Tiger Woods back and to see him playing with his son, that's just it's pure class right there. Watching his mannerisms so similar. The son so similar to the dad. You gotta love it. Um, next, like I said, I was picking up, you know, guys that I love watching. Aaron Donald right there. Another guy that I really enjoy watching. I like watching Rashawn Gary on the Packers and some other players. TJ Watt. Uh, Kevin Dyson Auto. Zach Moss. Tim Duncan out of 750. Shout out to Chappelle. My boy Ryan from Arizona. It's his boy. Picked this up out of 99. Shout out to my sister. Rest in peace. She went to UCLA. Um, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar right there. And then a little Ty Jerome Auto. So that's those pickups right there. And then we also picked up two slabs. I uh, watched this guy play in a senior open a couple years ago. Shout out to my boy Silver Blue. We actually met um, this guy, Tom Watson. PSA 9 right there. He's a pretty cool guy. Kind of. <laughs> Tom Watson right there. That's a story for another day. Uh, LeBron James, BGS 8-5 rookie. So pretty cool right there. Walked in and picked up two slabs. And then I also, Shep and Imran, before I left, after closing, got me to open a little uh, hobby box with them. We open a little Allen and Ginter, Topps Chrome. And uh, just show you just two highlights of the base. It's cool to see Anthony, well, I guess not cool, but interesting. Anthony Rizzo and the Yankees. And then this is really cool. Chris Bryan in the Giants uniform. So pretty sick right there. And then I'll just show you guys the highlights from the box. I love Allen and Ginter. It's peculiar. There's some cool cards in there. You can't really beat it. Um, so at a 99, Andrew Vaughn, Refractor, Kamala Harris, Dylan Carlson. I've actually contemplated PCing him. He's from Elk Grove, California. Might, might PC him. We'll see. We'll see. Alec Bohm, shout out to Ville Graphs. Little mini. Mickey Moniak. Actually, this is the Marlins uh, general manager, Kim NG. Very cool card right there. This is pretty sick. She went to Sac State. Uh, Alyssa Nacken, probably butchered the last name, but Sac State right there, alum. She was the first major league baseball full-time female coach. So very nice right there. This would be sick to get signed. Shohei Otani, Refractor. Roger Clemens Gold out of 50. Josh Bell out of 150. Jonathan India, Chrome rookie. Jared Kalenic. Uncle Larry, aka Andrew McCutcheon. Nice card right there. Jake Cronworth for the Padres. Actually pretty good. Shout out to the Santiago Sports and my boy I'm Var, aka Varsky. Tristan McKenzie, Refractor right there. Christian Pache, rookie. Chrome. So that's the pickups right there and the breaks. Very fun hanging out at True Sports Cards. And then lastly, I went to another local card shop. The first time I've ever been in this place. I'm in this process. I've been working out, playing ball, doing the cardio, trying to drop the quarantine 15. We've got a couple shows coming up in January. And uh, I've been picking up singles, um, you know, to collect obviously and some to put on Whatnot. Whatnot's obviously an amazing app. If you haven't tried it, I'll put my link down below. Whatnot's an app where you can bid on some of your favorite collectibles and cards. Um, really enjoy being on there. And I know some of you guys watching this have been on Whatnot. It's an awesome app and you can get some really good deals on there. So I, I was actually, like I said, going back to what I was saying, I was working out and I and I talked to my boy, uh, Chris, who is uh, from SAC as well. He sent me an Instagram. He said, you ever heard of this Black Tie Collectibles place? I'm like, no. And then I looked it up and it's like five minutes from where I work out. So I went to Black Tie Collectibles. I talked to the guys and this added up to 227 and we got it down to 160. 
160. So I spent 160 on all this. Um, shout out to Black Tie Collectibles. I had never been in there. They just opened up. There's a lot of card shops opening up, man, out here. It's, it's kind of crazy how many card shops are open now, um, but I popped in here. I believe in supporting local card shops. As someone that was always wanting to own a card shop, I love supporting them. I'm all in. I love going to these shops. Um, you know, my dream is to own a shop one day, but you know, time and place, it's just not my time right now, but I would gladly support local card shops. So I popped into this place and you know, it was, it was a great time. They, I felt like the guys from Hit Parade, Hit Parade, uh, the main guy, they're all good people at Hit Parade. They formed some amazing stuff. But I remember when Tennessee, I met him, he said, I'll take, take that one out, take that one out, take that one out. Well, that's how I felt when I went to this spot. So I'll just show you what I picked up. Um, just some cool pickups here. Um, picked up this LeBron James Revolution, KJ Hamlin. Mosaic Rookie Auto. Mike Trout. So this is 21. So I basically got this for like 15. If you average it, I think it's like $5.90 a card. But um, value wise, um, Mike Trout game used. Nice card right there. Tommy. Can't go wrong picking up Brady. I don't care. I always pick up a Brady card in some sort of deal. I pick up Brady or you'll see the last guy I pick up. He's in here. Plays for the Raiders if you want to take a guess. Picked up these Ricky Hendersons. Home and Away. Thought those were really cool. Uh, Carmelo Anthony game used. Carmelo's got a great following. Um, Howie Long out of... 80 red for the Raiders. Derek Carr refractor. LeBron James pink. Um, shout out to my boy Just Money Cards. I picked up a Matt Olson auto out of 53. I like these archives. Very cool looking card right there. Matt Olson. And then I love the way this guy's autograph is. Randy Arozarena. Look at that auto. Beautiful sticker auto, but still jersey auto. Randy Kyle Lewis Ricky jersey auto. Nice card right there. Um, this is pretty cool. Ricky Henderson red. And then picked up a couple Patrick Mahomes. I think the Chiefs are gonna be fine, man. Honestly, I don't know if you guys. Are Chiefs into the Chiefs, but I think they're going to be fine in the playoffs. Chiefs pink right there. Patrick Mahomes, MVP silver. I know he's got family and all that crazy stuff going on, but I still think uh, the Chiefs will figure it out. Will to win. And this is pretty sick right here. Um, out of 99, Reggie Jackson. Game used. Love it. Mr. October. And this is a cool card. Amari Stoudemire, Carmelo Anthony, uh, select 1415. I mean, remember this? They had Mike Bibby. Oh my gosh. Landry Fields. I thought he was going to be good. There you go. Amari and Carmelo. Jeremy Lennon ended up coming out too. And then this guy as well, <laughs> Jason Kidd. Game used right there. Those are kind of cool for the Knicks. And then I picked these raw Tua's up. So I'm going to make a point here. You're going to be, why did you pick up four raw Tua base cards? Where's the ROI? Well, uh, I'll tell you what, I am a memorabilia guy. Always have been. And Tua does an autograph signing. I mean, these are going in, you know what I mean? Um, shout out to Powers Autographs, P. Ryan Collection. Those are my boys. Very, very into the autograph card scene, um, signed and slabbed. P. Ryan collection and Powers Autographs, you know, they can talk all day about this. They are two of the guys that are in on this, that are great with this, um, you know, autograph signings, not a bad idea for some of these rookie cards. So I picked up these Tua's. Is Tua going to have a signing? Do I think Tua's the next big thing? I have no clue. I just, I stash rookies, you know, that are cheap. I mean, these were like average out. These are probably like two bucks a pop um, was what he was asking. And he did a deal on them for me. So I picked up the four Tua's. If he does a signing and it's like $40 per autograph or whatever it's going to be whole sale. I'd, I'd pay for that for one or two of those. So I'm always a guy that picks up. You'll see, watch as you see some of these pickups. I pick up some base rookies, um, not to sell them at shows, to honestly stash them away um, for if I can get them signed one day, maybe, or, you know, I can send them into a signing or I just stash the rookies away to stash them away. I don't have a problem. There's no, I'm not losing sleep over it. I'm not looking at the condition of these cards on the rookie, like base rookies like that. Um, I'm really going at it, you know, outside the box kind of thinking with that. So anyway, let's keep moving forward. Howie Long, Genesis, pretty cool card. I always like picking up Genesis. If you could pick up any Genesis cards, you know, under, you know, if you can get them 15 to 20, depending on the player, it's not too bad. I know the Howie Long buy it now is about 20 bucks. Um, that was a great, great throw in on this deal. 45 to 60, Tim Brown. And then I was looking for this other one, KJ Hamler out of 149 for the Broncos. And then lastly, I always pick this guy up. He's in every deal, I swear. Josh Jacobs, Superlatives Auto. So pretty cool right there, Josh Jacobs. Bama boy right there. Raiders still looking good. They did win last week. So Josh Jacobs auto. So that is pretty much it. You know, I love, love going to card shows. I love going to card shops. This hobby means a lot to me. And I'm definitely just so appreciative of all the support we've been getting. But for me, it's, it's this community. It's, it's the journey, you know? So if you haven't made an Instagram or you want to make a YouTube, I highly recommend getting on there and join us because this is a lot of fun and community aspect. I think the friendships and the memories have outweighed any sort of sale, monetary value or even you know us getting a following I would take the friendships all day and and it's been so fun um, and you know I'll say this documenting this process you know Sasha T and I 
I have talked about this and he, you know, he kind of planted the seed in my mind about it. You know, they didn't really record anything in the 90s during the car booms. And I think, you know, for guys like Sasha and I and, and other content creators out there uh, to document this process, it's been so priceless for all of us because we're going to look back on this. I'm going to have a kids one day. I'm going to have a wife, maybe a family in, you know, 10 years, 20 years, whenever it is, I have no timetable on that. <laughs> but um, I'll be looking back on this and just watch these vlogs and these experiences. And I I'm telling you guys, <laughs> we won't regret it. I'm so here 2022. I, I am 100% going to a ton of shows. I'm documenting the process and it's just, we're all in, you know, it's been such an amazing journey and I wouldn't trade it for the world. This has been an absolute dream and I know 2022 is going to be so much fun. So I appreciate everyone's support. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, do me a favor. If you haven't, please subscribe to the channel. It means a lot. Follow us on Instagram, Mojo Autographs. You can check out our website, mojosports.org for single cards box breaks and more and yes we're gonna have merch very soon 2022 be ready gonna launch hats sweatshirts all that good stuff I'm very excited for the future here and i will talk to you guys soon happy new year merry christmas happy holidays much love everybody we'll see you later